Okay, so today what we are going to be doing is talking about posting to Google+. I'm making this video for my mother, actually, who's in Australia and New Zealand for two months. And we got her set up on Google+, so she can stay in touch with all of us and we can keep track of what she's doing. Um, let me first start off by saying that anytime, that there's two ways um, to post to Google+. One is with a widget, and the other one is by clicking the Google+, icon. Um, anytime you see the following icons, this little camera, that means that it's going to actually open up the camera application of your device, whether that be a tablet or a cell phone. And when you click this icon here, that is the, pic the icon of pictures, it's actually going to select a picture that has either already been uploaded automatically via the instant upload protocol or that will be uh, selected from any of the pictures that are currently on the device. Let's get started. So if we click the Google Plus icon which also were in, or this icon here we'll be taken to the home screen. Now down here if this little square is red that means you do have a notification. If it's gray that means it will say zero and you don't. When you click notifications it will show you either new pictures have been uploaded or somebody has commented on a post. Here you can access your circles, your photos, huddles, or in your profile. Take a look at photos real quick. We'll show photos from your circles, photos of you, of your albums, and from your phone. In order for pictures from your phone to be have pictures in it, you need to make sure that instant upload is selected under your settings. And you can do that by clicking menu or on a tablet device there's a, a, a menu option. For uh, the Zoom tablet it's a picture of uh, six squares. It's right here. Um, for the Galaxy tab like this one it's actually just three lines. So we're going to go back. To view what people in your circles are doing click um, you can click stream and it'll show all circles and you can actually customize this and you can actually swipe to the left or to the right to actually see the, your different circles now from this from this page we also have three icons up here and number one is a circle with a check mark in it if you click that it will automatically look for a nearby location that you can check into and then you can add any comments select who you want to see it in terms of your circles also you can hit the camera icon to take a picture or to select a photo that's on your device and the little pencil is to make a post Now let's go back and use the widget. If we click this icon, it will take you to this screen, the Google Plus main screen. And if you click share, what comes up is the same screen that we've seen a couple times already. First thing you want to do is determine who you want to see this post. So we're going to click this little icon over here with the circle and the right arrow and we're going to select our circles that we want to see or we want to see this post and we're going to select family and friends and we're going to click done up here you can also uh, select individual people if you want in this square here we're going to type our message our status update there is no limit to how long that can be we're then going to select a location if we choose so we're going to say apartment complex. We're also going to, we don't need to take a picture, we already have one. So we're going to click that icon there. We're going to select this picture. And uh, if you actually click the image itself, it's going to open up that picture in full. You just click the little gray check mark and we'll select it. And then we're going to click the share button. Now if we've uh, determined that everything that we want to be sent 
is all ready to go, we just hit the post button. And then we wait. See if anybody's responded. We can click any of the icons and uh, see down here if there's any notifications. So that's some bare bones, uh, especially it would be great for uh, any uh, technically challenged individuals out there. But uh, I hope uh, you get some great use from it.